it was a, it was a game of two halves. You know, we survived the halftime with some foul trouble, got to the halftime of the lead. You know, it's a new game. The thing you can't do on the road is have self-inflicted turnovers. And we had two turnovers in the first 40 seconds, second half, it led to two baskets, a three and a two. It goes from nine to four. It's not just the five points you give up. It's the emotion you put back in this building. It's the emotion, the confidence you give us other team. And from there on, you know, we're kind of back on our heels a little bit. At the 10 minute mark, I think, nine minute mark, it's still a tied game. They had a bad situation, they score. I think to put them up two, intentional foul, two free throws, ball back out. Scored again, it went from a tied game possession to down six. Huge trip again. And from there on, we were just kind of trying to survive. Josh and Delano, you looked both their nights. So what was going on there? Well, Delano, whatever happens to Delano, he's a, he's a freshman. Uh, just where he is. Uh, tried to do too much and got himself in bad situations. For a little freshman, you can't do that. Josh, uh, this wasn't very good. There's no way I can wrap that up or say it any different. Just was not very good. Uh, you know, against the zone, you got to be able to shift gears and think and see some things. Just wasn't very good. Uh, five fouls, no points, like four or five turnovers. And again, you know, it's a tie game with 10 minutes going second half. We're, we're not good enough to overcome those kind of things. We need him to be a lot better than that. You think teams are going to want to try to zone you all on more, especially after what they see tonight? Well, depends on what chap you want to watch. They zoned us the first half, and they were down nine. You know, second half, we added to that. Like I said, those self-inflicted turnovers, intentional foul, those plays are hard to overcome. Again, uh, Washington's very good zone team. Uh, lots of things we can learn from it. We weren't near as good as you got to be getting that ball to the block. The block, you got to get that ball to the block. A lot better than we did. But those are things this time of year for us, playing against that kind of zone, uh, will help make us better. How much of a difference to make not having Deshaun in Well, we're not going to make no excuses, that's for sure. Uh, but I think you know the answer to that. Uh, you get a guy that, you know, is experienced, guy playing at a high post, athletic enough to really go do some things. And, uh, but again, you know, we had the guys we had. He wasn't with us for a reason, and we're not going to make no excuses not having him. So like Matt gave us a good, good miss night off the bench. Matt today. did. Matt gave us some energy off that bench, and rebound in the crowd. You know, you know, I haven't seen the intentional foul they called him for, but uh, those kind of things can't happen. But he did. He gave us some energy. And you thought Merrick gave us some good miss tonight too. Merrick played great minutes. I don't know how many minutes he played. He played a bunch. You know, Merrick's, that's not his strength playing against his own, really. You know, you got to go make some reads. And, but he played hard. That's all I can ask for. Well, what, how much do you think this game is going to help you guys, the experience of facing a team like this, can help you down the road? Well, Brad, we schedule this game for a reason. Naturally, we schedule it. You know, you always want to try to get a W, but uh, I'm realistic, too. I knew we were coming to the Holmes West. I knew we were coming to play against a really good basketball team. And I think our, our guys can take some confidence from this. You know, for 30 minutes, you're right there. Let's learn those next 10 minutes. Let's learn those first 10, five minutes out of the second half. It's so important when you're on the road to come out of that locker room and win that first four minutes. And we didn't do that at all. I don't know when they tied us up. Did they tie us up at the first break? It was by then, I think, yeah. We weren't very good at that time. And that, that comes from good point guard play, playing some poise, being able to get that ball that paint. You gotta stop runs by throwing that ball that paint some. And a point guard being able to deliver that thing, crucial times to the right people. Those two things uh, you gotta get better at. It.